Grace and Peace. It's the second week of Advent, and this week's theme is peace. Now, how do you have peace in a world full of so much uncertainty? The New Testament tells us that real peace is reconciliation with God and with other people. As it says in Romans 5, verse 1, Therefore, since we are justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. See, the peace of God is experienced through relationships, spiritual relationships and human relationships. And that's good news because we all know that the holidays can be stressful times and that stress can put some of our relationships on shaky ground. We need God's peace now more than ever. I want you to do something for me. Just relax, take several deep breaths, maybe close your eyes and remind yourself of this very thing. The Lord is with me. You see, when we know that God is with us, we can experience God's peace in a multitude of ways. If the world's peace is temporary, but God's peace is lasting. And if you want God's peace, then you have to fully surrender yourself to God. I don't know what you want for Christmas, but I do believe that we have real peace when we turn it over to God. So I pray that you have a blessed week. I pray that you experience God's peace in new and fulfilling ways. And until next week, when we talk about love, grace, and peace be unto you.